Okay, we should be back. My god, that audio is loud. Very loud. Let's turn it down. Bump. Okay. So, for those of you not in the know, Snake Pass is a game where you are a spineless snake. <laughs> you, you are, uh, it's a puzzle game. Let me turn this music down a little bit more. Uh, no. Oh god. No, I, I need a controller. Shit. Turn that down just a bit. Okay. It's just a fun little puzzler. Uh, what if I wanted to change easy default? There we go. Perfect. You didn't expect snake pass? You didn't expect us to go from typing of the dead overkill motherfucking cock slap things to this? Please, as soon as they said womb weasel, I knew I had to go and play Snake Pass. Let's go to Paradise Ranch, everybody. I I don't know about this game. I've never played this game, but I know of this game. This is the game that ukulele should have been. Come on. Let me let me at him. Give me the snake. His name is Noodle. Can you get any better? This is opening just like Ocarina of Time. This is just an Ocarina of Time ripoff. Wake up. Yep, completely. Something's wrong. Let's go to the gate, the Great Dicko Tree. We'll be stuck here forever. That little asshole won't let us leave Kuroko Village. Here it is. Yep. You are a literal snicky snake. There it is. They always called me cold-blooded. <laughs> oh my god, he eats the bubbles? Here we see the most dreaded predator in the world. The snake. The super gigantic... I, he's not a venomous snake, so he must be like a python or something. I don't think he has any teeth. Or maybe he's supposed to be venomous, and that's, that's the gimmick, is he's supposed to be able to bite people, but he has no teeth. Sneak snake. Oh, slither left and right. <laughs> this is gonna get rough, folks. Because this game has very wonky controls and physics. <laughs> Up we go. Have could you how are you propelling yourself like this? Oh my god. <laughs> Let's go! Black is touching yellow. He ain't venomous. Thank God we have you here. What do you think? You're you're better than me? Holding your head up high? Man, look at how good those snake graphics are. You can see them just wobble. That's crazy. Thank God you're here, Megzi. She knows about her snakes. The classification of these venomous nightmare creatures. Just kidding. I actually like snakes. You ever felt a snake? They feel really... Yeah, he seems very toxic. <laughs> He's very cruel. Hiding underneath that smiling facade. Not the keystone! Yep. Don't you just know everything, little hummingbird? What if I try to eat you? Come here. No, come here. Oh, I can't eat him. That's fine. Black touching red means every man is dead. Well, there you go, folks. Don't ever stray the, say the streams aren't educational. This might save your goddamn life. Black touching red. The stripes, of course. Oh, man. We gotta go try to get that medal. It's going to be a her Herculean effort. Can we say how nice this music is, though? Look how happy he is! We got shapes, folks. Bring this to the kids. They'll be traumatized for life. Apparently hummingbirds can pick up big fucking rocks. Let's go for that metal over there. Here's where the real game begins. Oh, God. 
That's right. Let's let's go. Go. Got it. Ah! Ho ho! Not even close. Let's go into the magical magic tube world. Ooh! He did it. So proud. And we only got one medal. I didn't know there was medals in this game. There's a lot of challenges apparently. Collectibles even. Courtyard clamber. Remember, think like a snake. Oh. Sneaky snake. Leskart! Leskart! Hello. Something doesn't feel right. <laughs> Hummingbirds can sense evil in the air. Yep, the world is now opened up and things are going to get complicated. <clears throat> so let's look for collectibles. If I know anything about... Oh, uh-oh. Uh... Oh, God. I don't think this was the way to go. Help me, hummingbird! I know you can fly! I get frog fractions vibes. Go, go, go! Ah! Uh, oh, my body weight! My body weight! Press Y if you want me to give you a lift. Yes, please! <laughs> Help! Oh, there it is. Sweet. You're actually being helpful. Come here. So when do you eat stuff? I'm eating bubbles. Isn't it obvious? Oh. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh, ah. Uh. And he died. And that's the end of the stream. Now you just get warped back here. To the very beginning of the level. With no judgment. No mean sayings like, Whoa, you really messed up there, didn't you? Oh, I'm stuck on the pole. <laughs> that was cute. <laughs> Falling off. How do you get to how do you get to voice act for this snake? Where, where's that application? I need some deep lore. Oh well, it's simple. Simple, really. Uh, a long time ago, there was a hummingbird whose eggs were eaten by a snake. How the hummingbird pecked out the snake's eyes and killed it, but little did the hummingbird know that the snake was actually pregnant with eggs, and in a fit of rage, the hummingbird began to destroy the eggs uh, in retribution for all the eggs that had been eaten by the snake mother. Uh, but one egg left, and a nice little happy face popped out, and that hummingbird adopted our little snake buddy here, uh, or something along those lines. Need to head up there. Go! My mother is telling me to go up there. This is some deep shit we're going right now. That's why, uh, that's why he doesn't eat the little hummingbird, because it's his mother. Dun, 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 dun. I don't know. I'm just making this shit up as I go. It's a snake that wants to eat bubbles! Common lore, true story. <laughs> See, that's why he can hum! Look! He does a little, like, whistle. How cute is that? When he wants to call his mother to help pick up his tail. And who else but a mother would be able to put up with this little snake? You know, it's a loving sort of thing. They're not just friends. It's a, uh... It's an interspecies parental... parental sort of thing. <laughs> I wanna fly! I want to climb up the walls. I want to reach the soaring heights like my mother. Get Nobi Nobi vibes. Bubble snake. Sometimes you can just be a cool ass snake. Look at that. Hmm. I'm getting Rayman vibes from this mask. Something just blew up. Toki Toki. Oh, right. That weird chick puzzle game. Uh oh. Look at this. Oh gosh. It's too. Where am I? The space is too enclosed. Checkpoint. Um. I didn't miss a bubble, did I? No. I'm getting the sense that there's a lot of. a lot of hidden stuff, and this is. this escalates really badly, I think. 
I've seen some of the further levels and it gets pretty fucking intense. All of the keystones are missing. Snake rattle and roll. I need to find all three keystones. Oh man. This would be perfect in a school. Just some nice little snake game. To 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 get away of the, the demonizing of snakes. See, but also teach that some snakes are safer than others. I do not know Snake Rattle and Roll. Please inform us what is the lore of Snake Rattle and Roll? <laughs> <clears throat> oh man, this is really hard to move in water. Oh look, he even holds his little breath. Look, he's got his air all puffed up. This is what kids play instead of Oregon Trail. This is why all our future generations will be snake handlers. If people had to say one of their most ed uh, beloved educational games, what would you say? Not that this is very educated. Why am I moving so slowly? There we go. It's like you ran out of energy. Hmm. Can the snake do anything else? Aside from that. Can you do anything else? Oh look, he can dance! He can dance. I hit a little button and he started dancing. Oh, he just gets a really happy... Can we just... Oh, we leave the smiley face on him. Look at him. Oh wait, he, he's got a whole little range of emotions. What are, what are these? Grip with left trigger? <laughs> Hold on, I want to see these emotions. We got... Worried. Content. Uh, seductive. Oh, worried. Desperately worried. Oh my god, what did I do to this poor thing? And then he's back to happy. Eh. Oh no, look, we can make him really at mad the more I hit on the directional button. Oh, he's determined. That's what it is. Determined. Surprised. Uh, oh, I even got a little achievement for expressions. How happy can you get? Oh, that's as happy as we can make him. Let's just leave him as happy. Yeah, he's making weird hurrying noises. Ugh. What are we doing here? Nope. The shapes! Go up. Go up. We got the square, everybody. Ooh, yeah, look, you can grip. No! Oregon Trail teaches best. If I had to put my money on it, I really like Math Blasters. Math Blasters was fun. Is that a big booger boss? Evil villain. Little Big Planet. Oh, I remember Little Big Planet. Hmm. Where in the world is Carmen San Diego? <sighs> I'll just say this: probably a lot of people had crushes on Carmen San Diego back in the day. That mysterious lady. Oh right, the bacon thing. I when I was younger, a lot of my. Uh, when I was younger, as if I say it like... You don't need to say that. You just just say when... Before. Way back in the day. Goodness, when I was younger. Every story is when I was younger. But, uh... It wasn't at my school, but at my sister's school, there would be a lot of... Ooh! There'd be a lot of, uh, Freddy Fish. A lot of Freddy Fish and his little point-and-click adventure games. When I was a youngin, wrap around and climb... You can't tell me what to do. My toddler crush was Sailor Mars. That is not a bad crush at all. <laughs> really anybody from Sailor Moon. Uh-oh. Here we go. We must get the ink and gold. We must reclaim it. That's what the snake is. The snake is a uh, embodiment of Incan traditions. And so we're reclaiming our lost gold. 
I did play Freddy Fish. Wrapped my mind around this. You played Freddy Fish. <laughs> okay, let's see. No, no, no. Save me. Save me. <laughs> my snake head. No, if I can pull this off. No, clip on the wall. <laughs> I died. I let him down. He bit the big bubble. We're getting that metal. Gunslinger wrapped my mind around this. Kingdom Hearts 2 is the same age as... Mm. Good lord. That's depressing. Kingdom Hearts is so depressing to think about these days. I don't... I don't even know why it bothers me. I've thought about recording Kingdom Hearts, but that that is a narrative debacle that I don't even want to open up. <laughs> oh man. Kingdom Hearts 3. The legend. I'm buying 3. I need closure. No judgment here. I'm not judging anybody who would buy uh, Kingdom Hearts 3. It's probably going to be a good-ass game. I'm just saying that the actual narrative of Kingdom Hearts is just a crazy thing to get into. No, get back. No. Mother, save me. Can I get back up? Oh, I got back. Oh. Oh. My mother hummingbird. Oh, my God. Ugh. Look at this. That's a sharp angle for your tail there. Oh my gosh! Nice. The Resident Evil 2, I I think Resident Evil 2 is going to be great. It's not a bad bet. This, this music is also very reminiscent of those early educational childhood games. Just sort of like a nice, general, like, soft jungle kind of theme, you know? Nothing too overly challenging. Nothing that's too catchy either. Just kind of there. there. No! 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 Oh, I still got it somehow. I ate that bubble with my ass. That's what it teaches the kids. I, I, yes. Okay, so, Hawkeye, which which campaign are you going to be doing first in Resident Evil 2? Leon or Claire? Reminds me of that one time playing Ark with a friend of mine and our crocodile tails bugged out and I made a 90... <laughs> oh. No, go, go up. Child just games to suppress the child inside. Right? There you go, this metal isn't even hard. Come on game, what do you think I am? Zero year years old? I really should crack open Code Veronica. I have it. Ooh. My controller rumbled. I think the snake took some damage there. Ouch. Um. I don't know how much longer we'll do this cute little snake game. Oh my gosh, it's only been 18 minutes? For some reason this feels like it's been going on for an eternity. What the hell? I'm confused. Play this for- no. I've, I've done this for not even 20 minutes. What the fuck? I could have sworn we'd been doing this like 45 minutes. That's really weird. I completely lost sense of time there. Go. Go up. No! No! I cannot tell you how weird this guy feels. Because you're only controlling his head. He's, it's just a propulsing pr head. Whee! Let's see. I've only been on lunch for 25 minutes. Feels like a really long time. I, I don't know why! I think because every little interact, even just moving, is so difficult. You get this hummingbird just watching over you. This is really oh, I need that metal. 
Look at the mother bird. It's like, you're not supposed to go up that way. But I'm doing it anyway. Lift me. There it is. Teamwork gets me some gold. Do I need to get this shape again? Really? Followed up with Doom? I would have no problem. But not Ultra Nightmare Doom. Fuck that. <laughs> no. Uh, no. What other games do I have in mind? I can't recall. Hold on. Let me see what other games I had in mind for today. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I know. Yeah, we'll do that one next. We'll go to something even more fast-paced, but physics-based. Oh yeah, the Stanley Pair! I should do that. Go to the Moon Lord. No! I'm never doing that. I went to the Moon Lord once in Terraria and he kicked my ass thoroughly, even though I had all the endgame gear. It was ridiculous. <sighs> There's a skull and crossbones way over there. We did it. Let's go. We're not going to worry about all these collectibles. We're just trying to see what kind of ridiculous shit they want us to do. Go up. Ascend, snake boy. You missed three bubbles. Way to go. Okay. Gatekeeper Guardians. This is where it really gets difficult, I'll imagine. This is where the boys are separated from the snakes. Yes, yes, yes. Sun shining. Check. Wind blowing. Check. Birds singing. Oh my god. Holy shit. Conflict. No. Not in our precious little world. What the hell is that? There was some kind of omnipotent sky god. Oh, oh man. Oh my god. I don't know what that was. Uh... Huh. How am I supposed to beat whatever that was? By strangling it? That'd be a dark way to end this game. Could you imagine? The end of the game is just you having to fucking strangle the final boss. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. It was really good. I'm glad you recommended it to me. I can't believe that one robot lady had a sword for her tits. That was crazy. Or like, she pulled out her boob and it was a sword. I don't know what that was all about. It was great. Nimbus has a boss fight out of nowhere. I can't eat these bugs. But I can eat these bubbles. Grip. There it is. Okay, slow yourself. Oh, really? I thought I was just going up here for giggles. Dun, bu -bu. Look, you can get that! Bird, you're right there! Look, you're... This is... This is ridiculous. No! No! Save me! Ow. Yeah, don't ever let me go. You're just gonna have to hold me the whole time. Look, it doesn't look very pleasant for you. I can see sweat dripping off of uh, the hummingbird's face. Oh wait, it sparkles. No, oh, you're just so magical, aren't you? Okay, why is this coin so easy to get to and the one over there was all the way like at the top of that horrible thing? Get it. That's a really highly detailed coin. My goodness. Good thing I don't got bones. Just have these big snake eyes. It's okay. It's a okay. Help me! Yeah, apparently. I didn't know that. We learned another thing today. We learned about snakes. We learned that hummingbirds don't sweat. They don't sweat the small stuff, like these Incan coins. So what, what's even the incentive for getting the coins? Do I get like a power-up? Do I get like at the very end of the game, do I get like a different skin for my snake? Do I shed my skin?
Oh no, Mixie, no. No, they wouldn't do that. The final, oh, whoa. Holy crap. Look, you could see the scales on his skin. On his scales. Let's get the, let's get the face going. Whoa. Too many colors, man. Eat that big mush. Oh man, we're way too close from the, to that mushroom. That's giving me a headache. <laughs> Why is the camera so close? Okay, there we go. Whew. If they gate off the final boss with like, oh, I'm sorry, you got to go back and get 40 of the ink and gold coins. That's gonna drive me crazy. There we go. Ooh, we're moving faster in water. Hmm. If you collect 100% of token and wisps throughout the game, you'll be giving a bonus menu with the ability to switch between both noodle oh, to 8-bit mode. <gasps> they know how we like our 8-bit nostalgia, those bastards. Really speaks to, to just the... Ooh! Look how quick you can go when you do that. That's cool. You know, it's a game I would stream if I uh, got my consoles all hooked up for streaming. I think I could. It would just take a long time. Take a headache, because I'm not big on... I haven't gotten my consoles hooked up for streaming, like, ever. Um, but I would love to record uh, God of War. That game is so ridiculous. For, oh. Slither for maximum speed. Snake. And I don't just mean God of War like the new one. I mean like classic God of War is ridiculous. The things you get to do in that game are just monstrous. Because Kratos is by far the most selfish video game character I've ever met in the... like ever. I'm sure he gets better in... like being selfish isn't a bad thing. Per I was gonna say he gets better in the new one I think, but uh... Being selfish isn't necessarily the indication of a bad character. It's just he's... He's this Ouroboros. He gets mad and he hurts people and those people hurt him back and... Then he gets mad at them for hurting him. It's just a real shitty situation. It's so funny. Because he does it all to himself. Just like all the best Greek tragedies. It's someone with a character flaw. In, uh... Oedipus's case, he was just too prideful. In, uh... What's his name? Ulysses' case, he just had too much adventure. And, uh, pillaged the wrong... <laughs> pillaged the wrong town and pissed off Poseidon. Uh... And Kratos? Well... Kratos just can't stop killing. Dun, 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 dun. I recommend a hard mode. Not give me God of War. I done it with platinum. Not fun. Oh, interesting. I've gotten pretty far in the uh, the new God of War. Actually, uh, I'm trying to think of where I was. I definitely beat the elf thingy without trying to give spoilers. Not trying to give spoilers, but uh, I think I I got past that thing. Do 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 do. Honestly, yeah, don't worry, no spoilers here, but, uh, it's fun. It's ridiculous. You should definitely give it a go. He looks like he's made out of, like, licorice. Have you guys seen those big gummy snakes? Uh, that you can get that are like 45 pounds or something like that. Okay, maybe not 45 pounds. Do, 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 do. I've already said too much about that God of War. So let's just move on to something else. I, sh I should play Bloodborne. You should! Go for Bloodborne. Definitely play it. If you like fast combat, 
I feel like gross bosses. Twenty six pounds. Yep. <sighs> I think we'll get through this level, and I think that'll be it for Snake Pass, because this is very slow. But we only need one more bubble. Oh my gosh. We got to go down the slide. You know, we'll see what the next. We'll see what the next level looks like. Maybe we'll get to see the the big villain. Doo -doo. Yeah, Dark Souls is... <laughs> I love Dark Souls, but I very much understand why some people do not... Why most people find it really just annoying to get into. Because it's not even just a difficulty thing, it's that some things in Dark Souls just don't work. is gonna be awesome. Like, as much as I'll sing the praises of the original Dark Souls, they really should have taken a few things out. Looking at you, Bed of Chaos. They could have done so much better with her, the Witch of Izalith. That could have been such a cool boss. I get what they were going for, but as is tragic. But even looking past that, I mean, stuff like... Oh, what's another big problem I have with it? Oh, but just the whole resistance skill to level that up. I, Fun fact, when I was actually playing through uh, Dark Souls for the first time, I put a fair bit of skills into resistance, and uh, it I got to, like, level 60. And a friend of mine messaged me and was like, Hey, uh, so how's the Dark Souls game going? I'm like, oh, it's good, but I'm still here. He's like, you're still there what level are you I'm like this and he's go he's like you shouldn't be having any problems right now what are your stats I'm like uh this 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 and he's like oh my god you put something into resistance and he it took a friend telling me and I had to restart my whole game because I fucked up so badly well, I don't know where this last bubble is so we'll just have to leave it be we'll have to be content knowing that somewhere out in the world there's a bubble I didn't eat I don't know how I'll live my, with myself. <sighs> you know, this is gonna be a... This is gonna be a controversial opinion. Hello, Nep. This is gonna be a controversial opinion. But, uh... I feel like of all of the Dark Souls games that I've played... I like Dark Souls 2 the most. Which is really weird, although... Dark Souls has the problem, or Dark Souls 2 has the problem of having too many bosses. Too much shit. You know, the stupid dice roll run of Dark Souls. Oh, look how nice I'm coiled up. Um, I really wish I had done that a little differently. Because that took so long to do, and I feel it wasn't very interesting to watch. So, if I was... I actually feel bad enough to the point where I would want to maybe stream Dark Souls 1 again and just do it normally. No challenges, just go through it to show that I'm not total shit at that game. Round and round we go. Okay. Let's at least get the lay of the land and then we'll move on to something else. Yeah. I... I really had even higher hopes for Dark Souls Remastered. And, uh, they fucked it up again. Uh, do I have a lot to worry about at Manus at level 1? Mmm... A little? I mean... Mostly, I would recommend getting... There's this pendant item you can get to block his dark attacks. That's the only really suggestion I have to make. I've beaten Dark Souls 1 on Soul Level 1. It's really not that bad. Because a lot of the damage that you do in Dark Souls is based off of your item equipment level. Rather than your, you know, your strength or dexterity or whatever. So, it actually isn't as bad as you might think. So, give it a go. Don't be too intimidated. This is a big snake. I can't even imagine doing Dark Souls 2 at level 1. Fuck that. You know, I, hmm, I'm trying to think of the worst boss I am against. 
I I have problems with uh, ceaseless discharge. I I've never been able to get him to do that stupid glitch where he just falls off the edge. He's, I yeah I'm bad with him. Uh, Artorius I haven't had too many problems with. I mean obviously the first time. Uh oh. Uh motherbird help. Oh I brought it back. I brought it back. No. Gotta slither up the wall is what it is. Oh my god, my head turned around. <laughs> Look at him, he's so scared. This is the face. Don't let me go. Don't let me go, please, mother. Uh-oh. No! A fun little game for fun little kids. <laughs> I can never trust... I can never trust again. You magical little hummingbird. Hold and grasp. Hold and grasp. Don't mind me, I'm just eating bubbles. Um, just be patient with Manus. Manus takes a lot of split second timing. Oh well, fuck that. Ancient dragon. I didn't even know if that was a real boss. I hit him and he just instantly killed me. And I thought it was a joke. The things, the things that Dark Souls make you do. No, mother. Oh, I like how she ditches you. Okay, good night, AK. You know what, with AK going, I think maybe it's time to leave Snake Pass because you can't play Snake Pass without AK. Oh, the bubbles respawn. Let's end with this happy man. This happy snake man. Boy. Twisting his neck around. Look at your demise, snake boy. Why are we so high up? What's going on? What kind of world is this? Lift me. Are you strong enough to hold me? Mother, a mother's love is not strong at all because she just leaves you. Okay. Progress. Let's see what progress I've made. Creeping Causeway. Huh. I feel like there's only one music track in this whole game. <laughs> Is it just me? I think it's just me. Let's quit out. Oh. Deceptive. A very deceptive little game. All right. Man, I can't believe that was only 40 minutes. That felt like an age. <sighs> Oof. Okay. I know, right? Yeesh, that felt like three hours. <laughs>